Yeah. One sugar, please, and make it a big one. <laughs> Paper boy! One day, hacker, I will read one of my articles from a paper that does not resemble a wet dishcloth or confetti. Uh, I see you're logged on and still obsessed with the Pilbury Bigfoot hacker. Well, let me know when you find him. That would make a front page story. Right. Trust my trousers to fall down in front of the Queen. She saw the funny side, though. I mean, she pretended to be annoyed and had me thrown out, but what she really wanted was for me to stay the tea. I could see it in her eyes. <laughs> Hacker, what are you doing? Shh! Incredible. <laughs> you know what you found here, don't you, Hacker? <laughs> you have discovered absolute convincing proof <laughs> that we own <laughs> one large walking jacket and a mop. I'm sorry, mate. I admire your enthusiasm, though. You'll make a lovely little reporter one day. Talking of which, Mr. De Lacey should be phoning any moment now with another top story. I know he will. I know he will. I'll tell you what, I'll phone him just to check he's gonna phone me. Max De Lacey. Sir! Ah, Digworth. Oh, yeah. I'm expecting a call about you from Buckingham Palace. Do you mean a knighthood, sir? Uh, no. Or for the imprisonment in the Tower of London. <laughs> oh, 98. Come on, Simon, put your back into it. This is just not good enough, Digworth. Any more mess ups like this, then you'll be jam making for the rest of your career. As long as he's not raspberry, so you say I'm allergic to it. Oh, listen. Listen. <laughs> Explorer Buzz Allen is planning an expedition to Pilbury Forest to research the very rare blue-spotted newt. He wants a member of the press to go with him, capture the scene on camera. Think you're up to it? My Cub Scout Nature Trail badge is still my proudest achievement, sir. Oh, your only achievement? Oh, you've been living in the wilderness for two days. So go prepared. Don't let this paper down. Your future depends on it. Oh. <laughs> Blue-spotted newt. If that gets the front pages, I'm a monkey's uncle. Whoa! The blue-spotted newt. That's a front page for definite. Huh? And living in the wilderness with Baz Allen. What an assignment. I'm going to start packing now. Fly cream. Mosquito cream. That's just normal cream. Never mind, I left some of that on my strawberries. <laughs> Come on, Hacker, get a move on. Ah. Look, never mind your Pilbury Bigfoot. This is real nature. The blue spotted newt. <laughs> no, I'll tell you what, Hacker. Leave the satnav. Let's do without modern technology for one day, shall we, and use our brains? There's a real map. Hacker? Hacker, what, what are you doing? This map's actual size! Where are you? Hacker! 
Right, no more messing about, all right? <coughs> Get the sat nav on and set course pronto. <coughs> the most direct route to Pilbury Forest. <coughs> Via <coughs> Kenny's Burgers, of course. <coughs> <coughs> I'm exploring the remote forests of Pilbury in search of the elusive blue-spotted newt. It's only found in the wildest parts of forest terrain, so we'll need all our survival skills, and of course that means it's essential to wear the right gear. Baz! Top of the morning, mate. Who are you? Dick B. D. Digworth, Pilbury Post, Cub Scout Rambling Badge and Certificate of Attendance, three-day camp, Gilwell Park. <laughs> oh, and the uh, runner-up in the stick-fetching contest, Pilbury Dog Show. At right. your service. Oh, oh, what's this? A few provisions, mate. Custard creams? <laughs> Strawberries? This is an expedition into the wilderness, mate. Not a Sunday afternoon at a theme park. Well, I'm sure even the bushmen of the Kalahari aren't averse to your chocolate digestive. Get rid of it! <laughs> Selena Sharp of the Gridlington Gazette. Digby Digworth, Cal Surprise. I thought the opening of the new boating pond in the park would have been more up your street. <sighs> See, you brought along your lucky mascot. What's she doing here? I thought this was an exclusive. I needed two reporters on this trip, mate, in case something happens to one of us. It takes two people to carry a stretcher, you know. A stretcher? Yeah, <coughs> it's a jungle out there. Well, a forest, actually, but you get my drift. <coughs> oh, Mr. Arrow, my friend would like to know if there's any truth in the story of the local Bigfoot. <coughs> Rubbish! <coughs> We're after the blue-spotted newt, my friends. We will shelter from the wind and the rain, using only the leaves from the trees and the branches from the forest. Now, let us leave behind the comforts of home and set off into the heart of darkness. Right, time to build our shelters. Make sure they blend into the forest. The blue-spotted newt must not detect us. Are you insane, Digworth? Do you want to frighten off every bit of wildlife for ten miles? I want a proper shelter there in ten minutes. Yes, you heard the man, Hacker. Huh? Go and fetch some proper logs. Okay, you cunning little blighter. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Come on, Digby. Keep up. Hey, this is harder than I thought. Are you all right, Hacker? Hacker? <laughs> what are you doing? You told us not to stray from the path. Look, if we don't get a shot of this reptile before Selena, I'm going to paint you blue and pretend you're a newt. <laughs> Still obsessed with the Pilbury Bigfoot, are we? Mm -hmm. Get the Bigfoot. The most important thing in this forest is the blue spotted newt. <laughs> Forget the newt. <laughs> Bigfoot, here we come. Follow me. What? Oh. 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 I think
think we might have stumbled across something. Nothing new there. He was stumbling all day. Well, could it be? Says here. Size 11. Leather soles, canvas uppers. Oh, wait, there's more. Baxter's footwear. Baxter's? That's amazing. The Bigfoot is wearing the same shoes I am. Idiot! He is you. You've been following your own footsteps. Nink on poop! Huh? We're after the blue spotted newt. And don't forget it. Yes, we're after the blue spotted newt. Don't forget it. Oh. 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 I don't know about you, Hacker, but I reckon we've got as much chance of finding this little newt as a needle in a haystack. I mean, what would you rather see on the front page of the Pilbury Post? Eh? A massive Bigfoot or a three-inch navy blue newt? All right, team. Start setting your new trap. So he wants a trap, does he? I'll give him a trap. <laughs> Thanks for your help, Hacker. Uh, now let's cover the hole with leaves so the Bigfoot doesn't suspect. Uh, Digby! That's a very big trap to catch a three-inch newt. Yeah. No, no. No, no, not at all. Because the, the newt will be expecting a small hole. They're, they're very cunning. So you wouldn't be trying to go after something bigger, would you? <laughs> We've got to work faster, Hacker. I think she suspects something. Mm. Hello? Well, Digbeth, tell me you've managed to get an exclusive photograph of the blue-spotted newt. I've managed to get an exclusive photograph of the blue-spotted newt. Oh, excellent. I'll clear the front page of the nature section. Hold on, sir. It's not true. Well, why did you say it, then? Because you told me to. Oh, you idiot. Oh, oh no, but I, I, I'm glad you rang because I, I think we've caught it. Now, l listen to this. Make some noises like a newt. Huh? Make some newt noises. <laughs> Did you hear that, sir? The primeval croaks of the legendary blue spotted newt. Ah, ah, ah. Remarkable creature. What other noises can he make? Ah! Wow. That newt has certainly got some vocal cords on him. That does it. I'm definitely clearing the front page of the nature section. Thank you, sir. You won't regret it. Oh. <laughs> go, Simon, go! Excellent lunchtime. I am starving. What's this? Cold chicken, ham, strawberries. I told you to get rid of this. We're living in the wild, you idiot. Off the land. There. That's your dinner. Beech leaves. See? That's how you do it. Excellent, Digby. You managed to catch some beech leaves. So much more difficult than fishing, I find. No, but in fact, I, I can fish as well. It is one I caught earlier. Pretty big chap, too. Put up a bit of a struggle, I can tell you. Show me this. It's frozen. I'm not surprised. It's very chilly in that river. Shh! Listen! The blue spotted newt! I can sense his vibrations! I think that's my stomach rumbling. Shh! We need to get out there! I'll come with you, Buzz. I can get a shot from 400 metres with this. Well, I, I, I've got a range of four feet with this, and it's got a built in flash. <laughs> now, Selena, you keep watch. You, come with me. Coming, Buzz. Good luck, Digby. And don't forget, you put the camera up to your eye and you push the button. Yeah, thanks, Selina. Which, which button? Oh. Digby! What are you looking at? Uh... Ah! <laughs> right. Let's see who'll get a picture of something a little bit bigger than a stupid blue newt, shall we? <laughs> He's close. 
We need to lure him. Do you know the call of the newt? Who recorded that? Your girls are loud. The cry of the blue-spotted newt, you fool. Listen. What? Use it, and he will come. Spread out. Good luck. He's balmy. Huh? Never mind the call of the new hacker. Huh? It's the call of the Bigfoot that's going to get us to front page. Huh? Come on, you big hairy monster. Come, that Digby. Huh? What was that? Huh? Did you hear that, hacker? Huh? It's the newt. Huh? It's coming from over there. You wait here, hacker. A shot of the newt is better than nothing. Huh? Coming from behind this bush. <coughs> Steady now, Digby. <coughs> Don't make a sound. I smell a scoop! Yeah! <coughs> I've got the new! I've got the new! <coughs> Baz, you do that new call awfully well. Have you ever thought of entering Britain's Got Talent? <coughs> no, that didn't sound like the new. See, it was it was too low. You've got to hit the upper notes. <coughs> yeah, that's more like it, Baz. What a day. Well, good night, everybody. What did he say? Well, it's like this, Digby. After you've jumped on somebody's head, they're not likely to be very chatty afterwards. Sleep well, best. Good night, hacker. <laughs> Oh, stop messing about. Come on, there's not much room in here. Stop it. Stop it. Do you know what? I think you're coming down with a cold, Hacker. I'll have to get you some medicine tomorrow. Oh, do you know what? I'm really hungry. Get us a sausage roll out of me bag, will you? I'm sure I left one in there. Thanks, Hacker. You know what? I think the old life in the forest suits you. Becoming quite muscular. <laughs> Good night, hacker. Uh, baby. <laughs> a photo of the Bigfoot. How low can you go? I wish I'd thought of that. No, steady, Digby. You've got to get a shot of her. What are you doing, Digworth? I, I, I've, I, I've newted the spot. Uh, blew the newt. Uh, spotted the newt. Yeah. Well, well, well. There. Uh, at least you found Hacker. Do you know what, Selena? I never thought that a fellow member of our noble profession would actually stoop so low as to actually fake a photo. How long have we known each other? Eh? Years, probably. Uh, I mean, we were at journalist school together, and uh, I always used to look up to you. Especially when I, was, when I was sitting down. It's not the point, you've let me down. And you've let yourself down. And you've let Baz down. I don't have to tell Baz because you've let him down too. 
Hang on, if she's, uh, if she's over there, then, um, it's... Selena, it's you. Oh, you're not still on about that Bigfoot nonsense, are you? You didn't take a picture, did you? Not exactly. I, I fainted. Oh, really? Oh, what a hardened reporter like you. Never mind. Looks like I've got the picture of the century. Huh? Oh, no. It looks like I've accidentally deleted it. You'll have to get another shot now, Selena. Oh. It's time we got some advice, Hacker. Huh? Remember, every top reporter needs a source. <coughs> no, Hacker, a source of information. <coughs> Sid the source. <coughs> Sid! <coughs> Sid! He must be around here somewhere. Here, watch where you put your hands. Who said that? Get your voice down. You'll wake up the woodworm. Last thing is I want them wriggling about. Sid, that is amazing. How do you do that? It's hard enough as it is. I've already got a woodpecker in me upper branches. Can't hear myself think. <laughs> there he goes again. Sid, how do you get close to a Bigfoot? Oh, I don't know. Oh, but flowers, uh, chocolate. I'm serious. So am I. There's nothing more powerful than love, Digby. Yeah, don't even think about it. Oh, come away, hacker. So you're suggesting I woo a big hairy monster? Yeah. All you've got to do is... Hacker doggy bank. Huh? Dress up as a nice lady Bigfoot huh? and you'll have him eating out the palm of your hand. Where am I going to get a costume from here? Oh, just so happens I've got one and, uh, well, it's going very cheap and... Oh. Wow. So, Sid, how does a female Bigfoot differ from a male? I mean, are her markings more subtle? Is her body frame less athletic? No, not really. She's just got longer eyelashes and uh, a skirt. Let me know if you see Baz Hacker. This would take some explaining away. How do I look? Right, here we go. Oh, how come? Who likes you? Probably thinks you're a little foot or something. Hold it there while I get a shot. <laughs> now hold on, you. Let's steady on. Marriage isn't something to rush into, you know. Let's take things one step at a time. <laughs> Just get this shot, and it's the front page for me. <sighs> oh, I think I've shaken him off. I've got to get my camera back. <laughs> Hang on, is that the real Bigfoot or is it Selena? It's Selena, the scheming cheat. She's got my camera now. She's going to delete all my photos. Huh? The legendary blue spotted newt. After all these years. Keep away from it, you big hairy beast. Baz, you don't understand. It's her in a costume. What are you blathering on about? Tie him up, man. It might hurt the newt. No, I'll prove it to you. Look, I'll rip the head off. Look, watch. Tough stitching on some of these costumes. <laughs> Nothing personal, Selena, but you really should see a dental hygienist. <laughs> Back up! <laughs> the real Bigfoot! Well, hold still, I can't get him! Back up! Do something! There it is. My life's dream. 
the last remaining blue spotted newt on the planet. <laughs> no! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, after years of searching, I present to you the legendary blue spotted newt. Oh dear. Everything seems to have gone a little flat. Do you know what, though? <laughs> I reckon one day we're all just going to look back on this and, and laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Hot off the press, Simon. Another award-winning front page, no doubt. <laughs> Found lesser-brained half-wit. Digby Digwood! How would you like to play the most gunge-filled, fun-filled games on a Saturday morning? Do you, along with a friend, your brother, sister, cousin or your neighbour, want to try and win some incredible prizes? If you've answered yes to all that and you're aged between 9 and 13, then Basil Swap Shop needs you. Basil Swap Shop is looking for teams of two to take part in the Saturday morning fun. So if you want to apply, just go to the website and click on Be On A Show. Closing date is this Friday, so hurry up. <laughs> 